I invite you to watch this concert from the Michael O'Neill Singers Archives. It is from May 17, 2002, and it is entitled Songs of Hope and Freedom, a Concert of African American Spirituals. Our guest conductor for this program was Moses Hogan, famed arranger, composer, and conductor. And we were so fortunate to have him with us that day because he had an untimely death less than a year after this concert and died at the age of 45. This was one of the last guest performances that he had. We were also fortunate that day to have Coretta Scott King in the audience as we performed a work composed by Moses Hogan in honor of Dr. Martin Luther King. His light still shines. We hope you enjoy Songs of Hope and Freedom. In a time and place where physical hardships and emotional anguish were a way of life for people in bondage, God placed into their hearts and onto their lips a song. So powerful was this song that in its words was hope itself. In its melody, the peace for which their hearts yearn, and in its rhythm, the pulse of the Almighty who sustained them. That song was the spiritual, and it survives to this day as one of the most deeply moving expressions of the human spirit. The spirituals were first sung by individuals whose names we can never know. The anonymity of their authors, however, adds to the poignancy of these songs, for it leads us to imagine the kind of suffering that press such music from their souls. In the words of the spirituals are expressed the deep longings and the naked faith of people kept by design from formal education. Their words, then, are necessarily simple and direct, conveying the most fervent desires for freedom and family, for peace and prosperity, through unpolished dialect and biblical images. The melodies of the spirituals likewise possess the haunting beauty that has simplicity as its handmaid. But in their simplicity is hidden a degree of harmonic sophistication that was left for subsequent generations of arrangers and composers to explore. Europeans, such as Dvorak, found in the spirituals a wealth of melodic material upon which to base symphonic compositions. But fittingly, it was a group of African-American composers and conductors who pioneered the art of arranging the spirituals for solo and choral performance. In the hands of early masters, such as Harry Thacker Burley, Hall Johnson, and William Dawson, the spirituals retain their lyrical directness and their emotional power, while taking on a new measure of harmonic refinement. It is upon the foundation established by these pioneers that Moses Hogan has built, adding to his own unique contribution to the deep river of the Negro spirituals. Tonight, you will hear three selections by William Dawson, representing the earlier generation's contribution to the spiritual. The remainder of the concert will feature the music of Moses Hogan, 
who has brought new life and vitality to this important American art form.
As Dr. Oral Moses stated earlier, the African-American spiritual evolved from its simple yet honest beginnings into early choral arrangements by pioneers such as Hall Johnson and William Dawson. You have just heard three of Mr. Dawson's classic settings, pieces many of us remember from our earliest days of choral singing. But the spiritual, is an evolving art form with new insights to be discovered and there is no one who has had a more profound impact in the past decade on the spiritual's evolution than our guest conductor tonight Moses Hogan there are so many superlatives that could be used in describing Mr. Hogan and his career but I encourage you to read about him in your program and let his music speak for itself. Suffice it to say, in the 12 years of existence of the Michael O'Neill Singers, he is our first guest conductor. I obviously... <laughs> I obviously uh, don't turn my chorus over to just anyone. <laughs> I can tell you that it has been a joy to work with and learn from this talented and generous man. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome 
Moses Hogan. Thank you, Michael O'Neill, for that uh, wonderful introduction. I thought that I had been one of several conductors over a period of time to have the opportunity to guest conduct this wonderful choir. When I realized that I was the first, I thank Michael for letting me drive his Rolls Royce. <laughs> and they are indeed special. Well, this is also a very special occasion for me. I am quite honored to have this guest conducting opportunity. And in view of all that has been said about the spiritual, I want to add one other comment so that we will place what we're hearing in the proper perspective tonight. John Work, who's a noted historian, who lived from 1901, and he died in 1968, made a very important commentary on the spiritual, and I wanted to share that with you tonight before I begin my section. He said, in the evolution of the arrangement of the spiritual, there is seen a growth of a form and style of writing which assumes the serious aspects of composition and the arranged spirituals must be recognized as a distinctive new, original music form. This is indeed very important. While I enjoy the various accolades that are shared with uh, my efforts to preserve the spiritual, I cannot take full credit. So on the opportunities that I have to perform spirituals or to arrange them or to perform them with my choir, we are excited. We pay tribute to the unknown bards who created this moving art form that we call the spiritual. We are not privy to the names of the individuals who wrote the text of, for example, Swing Low Sweet Chariot. These songs have come to touch our hearts, people of all races, and so, as I reflect on the circumstances that have already been mentioned to you about the conditions in which these songs were created, just as a reminder, slaves were not allowed to read or write by law. And the history, in many instances, of the spiritual has been transformed through the songs. What genius, not being able to write, but able to create a song. And therefore, I am excited on every opportunity that I have to guest conduct and to keep alive their important message of hope, as is stated in our title for tonight's concert. And so the songs are offered, ladies and gentlemen, in recognition of the unknown bards whose names are not on my arrangement. And for this reason, we are excited about this presentation tonight. So thank you, Michael, for your vision to acknowledge this wonderful part of the American music tradition, certainly of the African-American choral tradition. And your work over the years has certainly been encouraging uh, for all of us, for musicians. And so to the audience, we offer this next portion in tribute to the unknown bards who created this moving art form that we call the spiritual. Thank you very much. Oh, 
An organization such as the Michael O'Neill Singers could never accomplish its goals without the support of many. Certainly one of our chief benefactors is Roswell United Methodist Church, which provides both this beautiful performance space, but also our rehearsal space each week. We are deeply grateful. Please know that Roswell United Methodist invites everyone here to its annual patriotic celebration featuring the Sanctuary Choir and the Atlanta Wind Symphony, which will take place during the last weekend of June. You may call the church music office after May 30th for complimentary tickets to this special celebration, which will draw nearly 7,000 persons to three performances. And we are also grateful for the MOS board members who give unselfishly of their time, talent, and financial resources. They provide crucial advice and guidance to us as we strive to be a meaningful voice in the arts community. Two of our board members, who also happen to be singers, are rotating off the board this year, each having contributed enormously to this organization. Please join me in thanking John Braid, board member from 1992 to 2002, and Walt Bride, chairman of the board, also for the past 10 years, 1992 to 2002. I'm going to ask John and Walt to stand. Let's all thank them. Oh, 
gonna trouble the world. Those children don't we we
I'm gonna sing till the spirit moves in my heart. I'm gonna sing till the spirit moves in my heart. I'm gonna sing till the spirit moves in my heart. I'm gonna sing till Jesus comes. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my heart. I'm gonna sing to the Jesus, in my
Ladies and gentlemen, that composition was published with a very special dedication. I had the privilege of working on the faculty at Dillard University for 14 years, and it was dedicated to someone who was very encouraging to me during that 14-year period. And he, he is here tonight, and I wanted to acknowledge the presence of Dr. Samuel Du Bois.
there are in this world some individuals for whom I hold an inordinate amount of respect and admiration. One such person is the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. Knowing that Moses Hogan had created a beautiful and eloquent tribute to Dr. King in His Light Still Shines, there was no doubt in my mind about the need for its inclusion in this program. I knew we must perform it. It reminds us all, as did Dr. King, that songs of hope and freedom need to be lived, not merely sung. And ladies and gentlemen, I am enormously honored this evening to introduce to you a very special guest, Mrs. Coretta Scott King. Before our final selection, I wanted to have the opportunity to express my appreciation to these wonderful singers and Michael O'Neill on one other occasion. Um, indeed, the spiritual is alive and well in the hands of the Michael O'Neill singers. And this is also a very special honor for me. This composition was commissioned by the Choral Arts Society of Washington, D.C. for the 11th annual tribute to Dr. Martin Luther King, and it was premiered at the Kennedy Center. I've not had the privilege of meeting Mrs. King, but uh, I'm especially honored to have you present tonight in the audience to hear this very special uh, performance. So I wanted to acknowledge, first of all, your presence, and again to thank the audience for believing in our efforts on tonight's program. Thank you.
Luther King Jr. lit a candle whose flame grew little by little, demonstration by demonstration, and march by march into an illuminating fire of Olympian proportion. His fire was a fire by which America came to see both the sins of its racial past and the promise of a future big enough to encompass the dreams and gifts of all. Dr. King would have been the first to acknowledge that he was only holding up a torch lit long before a fire of faith passed on in the words of spirituals that were first sung in the time of enslavement. His ringing oratorical eloquence frequently implored phrases and images from songs that had buoyed and bolstered the spirits of those who came before him. The spiritual had a home in his heart, so it is no accident that Dr. King made his vow unto the Lord and never turned back. Baptist 
minister who had studied the non-violent philosophy of Mohandas Gandhi and taken it to heart saw in non-violent resistance the tool needed to move the nation out of the perplexing maze of racial injustice and on to the simple path of peace. You have 